Hello everyone, we will start talking about the Primavera 6 course and it will be first lesson it will be about general idea about the Primavera 6 we were talking about how to look into Primavera 6 and about home page how to change program password how to change startup windows and also how to set your language and about toolbars and how you can use it so when we start the program this window will appear, login to Bramvera and here login name and password it will be admin also, small letter and database if we work in network we can change it and put it our server to save all data in it and about password when we start the program we can change it and we will see how to change it so ok to start the program so this is startup windows it's name home and it contain enterprise data and the project data enterprise data projects resources reports tracking and the project data WBS activities and work products and documents so this is unactive and when we open a project it will be active because we deal with projects or open the projects because it's projects data so when we open a project it will be, it will be active if we want to change startup windows from edit user preference obligation we can change from startup windows so we can change startup and now it's home and if we want to change the password from here we can change password enter new password verify your new password and to change language from tools set language we can change language we have this language available we choose English ok now we will talk about toolbars so here title bar first bar is named title bar it show us the project name but we still did not open any project so no current project and here menu bar file edit view project enterprise tools admin help and this is navigator bar and if you want to show all toolbars from view toolbars we can show navigator bar bottom text if we want text here if you want text here ok and this is directory this navigator toolbar and this directory bar from view toolbars directory bar or from here we can press right click also to show toolbars and there is command bar and activity toolbar now it's unactive when we open activity it will be active and we will show how to be active about status bar this is status bar it gives us information about portfolio user data date and see here comment bar now it's active and this unactive because this icons deal with opened project and we still did not open any project so if you open a project here projects open a project ok now it will be active and about toolbars there is comment bar this is comment bars because now we open activities so it's now active also comment bar and activity toolbar this is activity toolbar and we will talk about this icons when we talk about activities and about navigator bar we can back to home direct from here or back to open pages from back and forward and if we want to back to home here we can back to home 
we talk about now directory bar this is projects it show all our projects and we can add a new project or delete project and some projects come with the program when we install it and we can add our project also and we can delete all the projects so from here we can deal with the projects and this is show the duration of each project and we have resources resources there's three type of resources labor non labor and material and we can add resources and we'll talk about this in details when we're talking about resources we have reports we can make general reports for all projects or special reports for open a project and there is a lot of type of a project of reports about the tracking when we make update and we want to following our projects to see our budget and duration we make tracking and we will talk about this in details when we talk about updating and this WBS work breakdown structure we can add and delete from here and we can deal with WBS from this page work breakdown structure also we have activities here the activities and this is activity details from here we can deal with activities and here duration and we will talk about this all in details when we talk about activities assignment that resources assignments resources that assigned to our activity and we have WPS and documents work products and documents like approve checklist contract bill of quantity specifications we can add from here what you want from documents or project documents also expenses project expenses so here we can add expenses and deal with expenses As there is default expenses come with program when we install it and we can add our expenses also three shorts here we can see three shorts and issues if you have issues to follow it and to see it and project risks from here we can see project risks risks and if we have delay and priority normal top we can change anything here and when we talk about this we will talk about all this icons in details and next lessons now we're back to home and this is the end of this lesson see you next lessons